a pioneering gene editing therapy has given nine-month-old K.J. Muldoon a new chance at life, and it could change the future of medicine. It's all been a miracle, and it's, that's the only way to describe it. K.J. was born with a rare disorder that causes dangerous levels of ammonia to build up in the blood, causing brain damage or even death. Unfortunately, about 50 percent of babies pass away from this disease in the first week of life. Instead of a high-risk traditional treatment, doctors at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia tried something never done before, customized gene editing. KJ's disease was caused by a single genetic mistake, one letter in his DNA out of place. Doctors had to find a way to fix that error without affecting the rest of his genome. He has one particular misspelling in one particular place, one letter. That's unique to him. After six months of developing the treatment, doctors gave KJ his first infusion in February. By the next day, he was up laughing, looking around, seeing what was going on. He, very nosy, wanting to know what was going on, playing with his toys like nothing ever happened. KJ is now gaining weight and hitting developmental milestones. But doctors warn it's still too early to know the full impact. There's some early signs of benefit. Um, I think we need more time to fully understand those signs. If successful, this could open the door for treating other genetic diseases, including cystic fibrosis, sickle cell, and Huntington's. And so this is just a first step down a path that I hope will be very long and, and help many of our patients, where we can really target the underlying cause of their individual diagnoses. Rhiannon Alley, ABC News, New York.